てるんだろうなと思って。You can show us what you bought. Uh, no, thanks. We have to go. Nope. You're going inside. Don't make this worse for yourself, kid. Or I will. You won't. Don't try it, punk. Sean. We didn't do anything, man. Leave us alone. <clears throat> a couple of fugitives you might be interested in. Oh, they ain't going anywhere. Don't you worry. Okay, fine. Thank you. What the fuck? Where am I? Oh, shit. Daniel. No, no, no. Don't do this to me. Police will get those two straightened out. Are you sure about this, Hank? I don't know. Then they'll be off our property and won't be our problem no more. If you say so, then. Well, I'll let you deal with it. No. Oh. Hey there. You finally awake? Sorry I had to secure you. But if you're innocent, don't act guilty. How's your stomach? It hurts. I didn't pop you that hard. You're all right. I, I feel like I'm gonna throw up. Just let me use the bathroom. Nice try. But I know who you are and what you did in Seattle. I saw it in the paper. Where's my brother? Wish I knew. Little shit took off. I'll find him. Don't worry. If you touch him... You think I'd hurt a little boy? Guess you didn't have any second thoughts about leading him out into the middle of nowhere, though. That's real safe for a little kid. If he's lucky, he won't end up like his criminal big brother. Just let me go. Please. You're the reason we need to build that wall. You hold tight. I'm gonna go get your brother. Shh. Come on. It's only plastic. He's okay. He's okay. Just get out of here. Oh, fuck my bag. Daniel. Looks like he's gone for now. Yeah, that's what I thought. Fuck. Wonder if I could get more light from it.
Wonder if I could get more light from it. Daniel must be scared shitless. I can't leave him out there. What? What is? Sean. Sean. Daniel, I'm right here. Are Are you okay? I I, I think so. That old guy chased me into the woods, but I, I think I lost him. Is he gone? I'm really really scared. <laughs> hey, Daniel, you're doing great. He totally fooled them. Thanks to you, we have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah? Yeah. We gotta hurry, though. He called the cops on us. Think, dude. There's gotta be a way out of here. Can you try and open this vent? We'll figure something out. I don't even want to... Oh, yeah. This racist shithead is a real pillar of the... I'm sorry, but you married an asshole. There's a window over there. Maybe you can find a way in or something. Attract him. Hey, you think you can open the back door? I don't know. It won't open. It's locked. What do I do? I don't know. Let me think. <sighs> of course, the fucking keys are all the way over there. Yeah. Don't worry. I'm almost there. Hey, the old guy's gone. M maybe you can enter from the store door. Why did I put us in this situation? Oh, shit. Okay. Anything else you can see? Right. Okay, Daniel, I see some keys, but I can't reach them. <sighs> Maybe I can get them if I can pry this pipe off the wall. Can you find some kind of tool out there? I don't know where one is. Find me something sturdy, like a, a screwdriver or a wrench, anything. But where can I find one? Enano? 
I can't really see much from where I am. There should be some tools nearby. Okay, okay, I'm looking. Daniel. Come on. Let's do this. Yes. Good job, bro. hit you? Did he? No, he tried to grab me, but I got away. Okay, we need to cut this off fast. How about these? Dude, Brock, did that asshole see you? No way. I'm invisible. Yeah, you are. Okay, now we gotta get my stuff and go. What happened? What? What did you do? I, I don't know. I don't know what happened. It's okay. You're safe now. You fucking little spick! You and your brother are going to jail for the rest of your lives! The hell with you!
crazy. And I thought I was having a shitty day. I knew that guy was sketchy. Why did he freak out on us? Good question, my friend. There are a lot of messed up people out there. And you're throwing a little racism. Yeah. I don't think he was down with our last name. Welcome to Redneck Land. This ain't Seattle no more. We only lived in one place my whole life. Kinda lame, but... Well, you're pretty young. You have time. That's what's great about traveling. It gives you perspective. Sometimes maybe too much. Well, don't let it phase you, little dude. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. <laughs> What's under the blanket? Come on, I'm not stupid. <sighs> Daniel. What? We saved her. <laughs> We're heroes. Are you kidding me? We can't keep a dog. But, uh, we couldn't leave her with those mean people. <laughs> Don't give up, Daniel. Lee's on the ropes. Jeez, come on. We need a dog. Bet Dad would agree. <sighs> just, just stop. <sighs> you win, but you better really take care of her. Deal. Thanks, Sean. She's gonna be so quiet and... And, and what should we name her? Hey, your dog, your choice. Oh, cool. Let's see. Um, mm, how about uh, mushroom? She totally looks like a mushroom. Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Not much of a girl's name, though. Who cares? I'm sure she loves it. So do I. <laughs> All right. Mushroom it is, then. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Thanks, big brother. See, Mushroom, you got the best name ever now. <laughs> mushroom. <laughs> nice. I feel like I just witnessed history. You're on your way to becoming official road warriors, my dudes. <laughs> so, what do you do exactly? Long, boring story short, I come from a family with money, but no soul. I took off after school and never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites, do podcasts, protest, try to make some positive change. Yeah, whatever. Wow. So you're like all political. Everything is political, Sean. Are you, like, famous or something? <laughs> More like, or something. People in my network know who I am and vice versa. Well, that's enough for me. <laughs> Sounds pretty awesome. <laughs> I kind of wish I was famous, too. 
Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, I'd be like my family. End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? Yeah, you did watch out for us. Thank you. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh, good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah, and feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? You okay to drive? Oh, yeah. This is my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious. Look at that. Oregon is like the edge of the world. Hmm. Hey, listen. I know what happened with you guys in Seattle. Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call. No pressure. I... I don't even know what happened. It was so fast. It was the police. It's their fault. Dano just wanted to play zombie outside. Our shithead neighbor was picking on him. And I got in a fight. So dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops and, and they shot him. They killed my dad in front of me. One second my dad was alive. Then... Then... Fucking cops. Hey, it's gonna be alright. Take a deep breath. Listen, I'm really sorry this happened to you, man. Injustice is everywhere. And you're taking the brunt of it right now. But you're gonna be okay, Sean. I wish I could go back to my town. 
Even if it was boring like that one. At least I've had friends. Family. A home. I used to bitch about it so much. Now I've got... Nothing. What is sure is, that's the past. But you can't look back now. You've got each other. And you have to move forward. Why? You may not see it, but what you and your brother have is the most important thing. He needs you. And you need him. I can tell he doesn't know what happened. Sean, at some point, you're gonna have to tell him. I can't. Isn't it better if he doesn't know? If I found out, he's gonna find out. Better he hears it from you. I wish I could change everything back. So none of it ever happened. I... I just don't know what to say. But I'll try. So then, what's your plan? Where are you going? Good question. I was thinking... Get out of the country? Fuck it. Go down to Mexico, you know? <laughs> Damn. I thought I was the long-haul traveler. <sighs> Maybe this is crazy, but... Should we just keep going? Till we get to Mexico? If you think that's the right thing to do, yes. This is exactly what you're supposed to be doing. You have family there? Maybe. We don't even have family in the U.S. Except for grandparents. We don't see anymore. What about your mom? No. No way. She's... out of the picture. But Dad, he always talked about this plot of land he owns in this little coast town, Puerto Lobos. That's a pretty cool name. So it's got it. Okay, so you've still got a long ways to go. We've shot the shit long enough. Time to hit the road. Listen, I'll drop you by a motel in a couple of hours. You guys could use some time to yourselves. Okay, Mushroom, you can chase me. Then, Sean. <laughs> um, no. Come, see if you can catch me. Ow! <laughs> Glad to see him act like a kid again. How will I tell him? Hey, let's play fetch with the pup. Really? Yes. Let me do a test throw first. Cool? Well, okay, but I'm next. Okay, puppy. Go wide. Come on, 
one, Mushroom. Get it! Go, Mushroom! <laughs> Good doggy. I think we need a frisbee. Now she wants me to throw the stick. Okay, here. <laughs> Watch how fast she'll get the stick. You go for it. Just don't throw it too far. I won't. I swear. I mean, I promise. Come on, mushroom. Come on. Look, it's a stick. Fetch. Get that stick. Looks like these two are getting along. It's good to see him like that. Well, I got you that room. Seriously? I... It's only a room. No big deal. Look, I had tough times when I started out. And some strangers saved my life. 